Jeff Snyder here at the Kia Telluride Supper Suite in Park City, and I'm sitting down with the team behind Save Yourselves, uh, which sounds really Wee. exciting. Um, so let's start, uh, Alex Delano. Tell us, you know, how what was the genesis, the genesis of this project? How did it come together? Tell him, Eleanor. It was Eleanor's idea. She has to explain. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't know. It's just sort of a, a thing that we all have, I think, a bit of a fear of turning off our phones and something bad happening. <laughs> and so we just kind of were like, what's the worst thing? And we thought, aliens. So, um, yeah, that was just like, it was really just like a very basic premise. And then Alex and I started writing it together, or kind of brainstorming ideas. And the more we got into it, the more it sort of became a deeper themed movie, but also a very, very funny comedy. Yeah. <laughs> And had you guys worked together before? No. Uh, we're a real life couple. We have worked together oh. in different capacities, right. like producer, editor, shooter, whatever. But this was we the first time we were, wrote a movie together and directed a movie together. So That's pretty cool. Yeah. Yeah, it was great. But Sunitha and I have worked together a lot. Oh? That's true. Tell, well, tell me about the history then. Tell me about the whole history. It was 2004. 2004. And Alex and I were in the same class at Emerson College. We were like buds nice. when we we're at school together. Yeah, we had speech class. You guys are in the yeah. Emerson Mafia. Nice. Yeah. yeah. Are you in the Emerson I'm a Mafia? Bo I'm a Boston boy. I'm not in the Mafia. Oh, Thad is. Wait. Thad's over. Nice. Cool. <laughs> All right. Can we get a quick panel? <laughs> Let's bring him in. He's directing. <laughs> yeah. Um, if, you're, if anyone else is from Emerson, now speak <laughs> no, now. No, I don't want to keep John. doing this. <laughs> John feels very Sorry left out. Sorry to interrupt. Go on. Yeah. John, where'd you go to college? Uh, I went to a few different colleges and I dropped out. But I'm not at liberty. To but you discuss. still made it. You made it to Sundance. That's the important thing. I did. Even the, your disadvantage. Even yeah. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Eleanor dropped out too, too. So we got two dropouts. I dropped out, yeah. Two Emerson grads. Oh, yeah. University of South Australia. Who Anyone? Who Anyone? Needs a film degree anymore. <laughs> Oddly me. So, <laughs> John and Sunita, what attracted you to this script and, and made you want to play this, this, you know, these characters who unplug and have to reconnect? The script? My buds? John. <laughs> Yeah, likewise. Everybody seemed cool. I knew Sunitha before from the comedy scene in New York, and we were friends, and I was a big fan. And um, the script was really funny, it's and so, it seemed yeah. like it would be um, chill to make. Well, it's such a <laughs> cool chill. opportunity. It really is like, I can't believe that I, my, my friends wrote this, <laughs> and uh, we got to make it happen together. I know all that's really vague, but I just can't believe it happened. And it was like... Um, a very interesting thing you know like when you meet you know you're at like your parents office party or something for some reason you're there and you hear like other people talk about your parents and mm -hmm. you're like it's right. interesting you see them in a different you see them through uh, different people's eyes <laughs> and that's like how it felt like we everyone was just rising to different occasions and like it was really lovely to see friends through different angles and like just be so in awe Again, and See, they had low expectations of us. It sounds yeah. like they never call, <laughs> <laughs> they never come over, <laughs> and they invite me to Woodstock for three weeks, <laughs> and it was okay. Yeah. And then, so, Alex and Eleanor, have you ever like ha been in this sort of situation, not with an alien invasion, <laughs> of course, but have you, you know, felt the need no, to reconnect and unplug and get away for the weekend? Uh, nope. <laughs> no way. That's insane. No, I, I sure it's a nice idea. We right, don't we actually don't do find that that would be very valuable. We think that it's probably better to just like do something for uh, the planet or you know a yeah. political cause or something, rather than just like disconnecting yourself. to yourself. Yeah, I guess that's sort of. But like we the do love our characters. Right, but I mean that's sort of like one of the points of the movie is like these guys are upstate trying to like you know discover themselves and do all these things, and it's like meanwhile the world is actually ending around them and you know we're kind of all a little bit self-obsessed to to see it yeah if the i mean if the world was actually ending would you want to know or would you want to be just be blissfully ignorant about it mm. yeah, yeah. <laughs> well how fast is it gonna end yeah <laughs> if it's fast like blissfully ignorant for yeah. sure <laughs> yeah the world it's cool to like maybe try and see you have to use camera. a microphone this is yeah. insane we're editing my shit out <laughs> <laughs> yes uh, sorry yes please try to use the mic uh, when you can uh, so we can always pick up this comedy gold i'm trying to help <laughs> you, man. i'm trying to help you. it's so. weird that i it's like i don't want to be helped or something <laughs> yeah. it's like don't save me <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> to save yourself sunita save uh, yourself. what i mean what are these aliens after in this movie do we know why there is an alien invasion fame well, fame obviously yeah fortune <laughs> but um 
Yeah, I mean, that's actually one of the things that we sort of avoided, actually, in, really, in this movie. There's, there's, there are, like, some tangible things that they're after that um, happen in the script, but we were trying to kind of not go down that, that road of, of sci-fi where it's like the hero discovers the thing and saves the day. Um, it was just kind of trying to flip that every time you think that they're about to figure it out. It's actually just... It, you you finished we my were, sentence. Well, we were talking about this before, like movies that I love, the apocalypse type movies from the from like the '90s that I love, like uh, Independence Day or uh, Armageddon or something. Mm-hmm. Like they sort of figure out what's going to cause the wor- world to end. They learn about it and then they solve it. And that was like, a great '90s feeling. Like everything was optimistic if you lived in the states. And, then, like, <laughs> um, and yeah. now, like we're a little more aware that like uh, like offshore oil drillers aren't going to save no. us from like a meteor hitting the planet and like a guy from the CIA isn't going to like like outsmart the aliens invaders you know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. even though Jeff Goldblum is great so we have like I feel like we we're just trying to make a more realistic movie yeah he, he, Jeff Goldblum actually did he said no to the part <laughs> he, is he said no to the part right of now. co-director and he Jeff? went to Jeff, Emerson come on College out. Jeff <laughs> yeah. uh, out of here guy but I do love Independence Day and Armageddon yeah. just want to point oh, that cla- out classics I mean <laughs> Armageddon's a criterion uh, it's in, it's in it, the did collection. Did they do it? Oh, they, it's in there. They added oh, yeah. it to the collection? Is yeah. it because of the song? <laughs> yeah, I think so. That That's it. Um, <laughs> yeah, Aerosmith yeah, song? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yes, The Rock is in it, too, honestly. Uh, the rock. What? Oh, my the God. Rock is Criterion? Thank you yes. for being honest with oh, us. Oh, <laughs> the movie The Rock. Yes. <laughs> with yeah, yeah. Uh, Nicholas Cage. Right. Right. And Sean yeah. Connery. Yeah. We're getting way off topic, guys. Yes, yes, yes. What would you guys do in the event of an actual like alien invasion? Mm. Probably something pretty similar to what these guys do, but uh, movie, I don't yeah. know. God, it's so it's, it's just so upending. How do you, how do you yeah. know? I, there's like been a few. I live in New York, and there've been like a few sometimes conversations with my husband of like, oh, we wouldn't get on the subway. Like, <laughs> would, yeah, yeah. Like, we wouldn't go underground. Should, would we meet back? Would we try to just like get back to the apartment? Or Should like, we live by the BQE? <laughs> <laughs> We do live by the BQE, so come over. I don't. I don't. It's so hard to know. I would probably run and then die. Hopefully, yeah. I would like run yeah. and get struck by lightning. It Just depends. get out of the way. It depends on like what's happening, the yeah. situation. You know, you have a couple schools of thought. You could find a Walmart and lock it down. <laughs> uh, you get a yeah. squad of people who know how to do different um, things. Uh, you find water. You go um, squat in a cabin by the water because you're gonna want the water. Yeah. If you were if you were binging Succession, you'd probably want to finish too. Oh yeah. Yeah. Sure. We just sure. we, we just binging. watched it on we the plane. That, yeah. Oh, we didn't finish the season though. Yeah. Succession oh. slaps. Oh, you guys got unfinished business with Succession. <laughs> um, we had this one line in the script that I we cut from the movie, but it was my favorite. It was someone texting them saying like. Uh, do you still have that air mattress? I think we can use it as a raft. Yeah, <laughs> I thought that was like the funniest line. Trying to get off Manhattan in it. an yeah, air yeah. mattress. It's like, what do you do when you don't have any survival tools, <laughs> like <laughs> external or internal? Yeah. Um, you guys have a comedy secret weapon in this movie, and that is John Early, oh. who I'm a big fan of. <laughs> so, uh, what, what, how does he fit into this story, and how'd you lock him down for this? I wish we used lock him more. Him yeah, actually, he's, he's, in, Early, he's in demand. John Early was yeah. actually how we locked him down yeah. in the movie. John introduced, okay. John introduced us to John. All right. Yeah. John's our, our friend. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and he did his, he did his to being a cool guy. Yeah, he's a funny pal, but he is so funny. Yeah, and he's on Search Party with the John and John are on Search Party together. Yeah, We're and sure John owes me a lot of favors. I've been <laughs> yeah. doing stuff for John over the years. Yeah, yeah. the last favor that well, it's, it, that sounds terrible. The last video that you shot for John Early, we were like, only if you will be in the movie yeah. when we did make we, it. But we that, didn't say that. I think we text him that. <laughs> yeah, you did. I never would do that. You did. Anyway, I didn't do that. John okay. knows. Probably it was. Maybe it was a joke. I think that was a, that was like before the movie was a real thing. Anyway, <laughs> it was just like kind of like a yeah, be in the movie. But the timing was right. He was in New York at the time and he had a window of like an hour and a half from like 7.30 to Guys, he would hate us talking about him. He would like hate us talking about him. Okay, then let's move on. I don't want to upset John early. Uh, John, you are in another movie here at Sundance, right? Horse Girl? What, are you just like uh, working with people on Glow? (laughs) Um, Yeah, exclusively. Uh, Fun fact, I auditioned for a part on Glow and didn't get it. Sunitha, care to comment? Sorry, I just (laughs) felt like it wasn't right for you. You yeah. gotta go to the Peanut Butter Falcons wrestling school. Maybe I guess so. <laughs> Maybe then you'd get on. Yeah, then I get on. John's just 
the best. That's why he's in two movies here. Um, and nice. the cast of Glow is so good, and that's why they're everywhere. So, and so, yeah, I was going to say, Sunny, are you planning to see your Glow co-stars movies here at the festival? There's so many of them. There's, You've already run into a bunch. Everywhere. I've, uh, I have. I the schedules have not timed out. I missed Gales, mm. uh, which was this morning, and then. Allie and John's is tomorrow night, and I won't be mm-hmm. here. A oh, promising young woman's tonight, though. We got, oh. you got Chris and Allie and that. That's right. Yeah. Oh, wow. And, oh, no, not Betty. Yes, I that's the, true. There's a P and I guess slip in there. It was good. It was good. I went, we're going to try to see Horse Girl, too. Yeah, we're here all week, though, yeah. so we can we can see that later. Yeah. Guys, this is uh, the, the team behind Save Yourselves. Make sure. Is it plural or yes. singular? Yes, that's okay, right. save yeah. yourselves. There's, there's I want to make sure I got that point. right. Yeah. Make sure to check it out at Sundance this week. Thank you to the Kia Telluride Supper Suite for hosting us. Thanks for coming, guys. Thank you, Thank Thank you. so much for our Kias. Hey. Thank you so blind. much for our Kias. <laughs> Mine was lost in the mail.